You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures TV. Why are you crying? What is the problem? You're not talking to me. Why the, why the listen, tears? Listen, please. Just stop asking these questions. Stop it. Now I know the reason you told me my sister always spoke good of me. How decent a woman I am. How I would be the best thing any man would want in his life. Really? So did I did I know that you were you were saying those words to me just, just to get me in bed to satisfy your selfish desires? Oh well good. Fine. Now that that selfish desire of yours has yielded something, be ready to embrace it because it has given birth to something very big. I don't really get it. I don't know exactly where you are driving at. You want me to speak Latin before you understand what I am saying? I'm pregnant. that I got pregnant for my late sister's husband only a month she died and probably give birth to a bastard because nothing on earth will make me terminate this pregnancy I would do it but this is not fair this is not I did this so I could I could help my late sister take care of her son since you're not always around and and help you get out of this emotional trauma. This is what I get. What were you even thinking? Did you even think of your reputation as well as mine? Well, I hope you will not be embarrassed when the world gets to know of this our shameful act. Why are you so
Not again. I know how hard this is for you. I understand the pain you're going through. I know I know it's not been easy for you to get over your wife. I know how hard it is to forget her death. But this is not the best way. You're going about it the wrong way. Listen. That's why I'm here. Okay? I'm here to fill the gap. To make you feel better. To make you feel like a man. To make you happy. To give you joy. And make you complete. That's why I'm here. Even if I know it's really a hard task for me to do what I'm just going to do the little I can. Okay? Um I'm I'm going to take you inside right now so you could um have your bath and have a good sleep. But first, we need to take this. So, come on, let's go. Mm? Let's go. Mm. Stand up. Mm. Oh. Just stop it. Stop, stop it. You're my sister's husband. Stop, stop. Stop, stop. Stop it, stop. of marrying your sister's husband barely one month after she's been buried. Asama, your twin sister. Hello. It is an abomination. why you're asking all this. Really, I don't know why you're asking. I just want to marry him so I could take care of him and my late sister's son. Simple. Is that supposed to be a big deal? <sighs> Moreover, what I'm doing should even be seen as an act of charity. We only came here to tell you so you could give us your consent. And I don't know why you're condemning me. <sighs> Moreover, I'm pregnant for him. I choose to pay deaf ears to that.
you seen it? Have you seen the kind of humiliation you have subjected me to? I'm going through this because I, I just wanted to help your late wife out. Nothing else. And now see the way grandma reacted. And I'm just doing so that she can be happy wherever she is. You just look at the shame. You see, right now I'm just very confused. I just hope... Okay, what do you suggest we do? Huh? Do we even need this village stuff? I mean, we can... We can forget about it. Go to the court, get wedded in the court. Case closed. We don't need to... to come back to her. I can't stand this shame. I can't stand it. It's too much. I said it. I said it. That nothing, no obstruction, no human would stop me from getting what is mine. And I got it. Asama got it. Where are you going? I am asking you, where are you going? Are you deaf? Am I talking to myself? Where are you going? And I hope you did everything I asked you to do in the house. Yes, I have. Yes, you have. Did you scrub the floor like I instructed? Yes. Yes. Good. I hope you filled up all the gallons at the backyard. Because as you know, your father did not leave any money for the spoiled sumo in this house. He did not leave any money for us to repair it. So I hope you first told what I asked you to do. I will do that when I am back from. Hey, back here! Back here! Come back here! Stand up! Look at this idiot! You will do that when you return from school. As what? I am asking you, as what? As the man of the house, big man. My friend, will you run back and fill up the gallons before, before, before I slap the living daylights out of you? I would do that when I'm back from school. I am already late. You are late? You are late? Whose business is that? Listen to me. If I slap you, if you're not know what? My friend, run in there and fill up the gallons before I dash you backhand. That's a game over. Idiot, what do you know? You want to go to school? Dollar, look at you, slow worker. You are working, Johnny Walker. What when I now I'm now I'm here Keeping your face as if someone is suffering you. Why you not the right thing to do? You won't do. I just stand there. Hi, yes, sir. It's what? Descendant of the dead. Don't you think you're rather being too hard on this one? Eh, eh, Pina, what do you there? Hold it there. Who cares? This little thing knows nothing other than to eat my food in this house. Yet he won't get fat. And the people will think that I'm suffering him. Yet he eats everything in this house. You see the punishment he's getting? He deserves it more than what I'm giving to him right now. This little thing talks and does things that are bigger than him. When his father comes, he starts running his mouth like spoiled tap.
said you love me You said you never leave me alone Why did you go away and leave me here And I'm looking for you everywhere Mommy, I miss you I miss you, Mommy Mommy, I miss you I miss you, Mommy The sun sets, and afterwards, you will explain to me why you left this house with a gallon and returned with a hole in it. Idiot! I don't blame you. All you do is eat the food in my house. Go! Shut up your mouth! Please forgive me. If I gave you, you are sorry. Are you sorry for yourself for your stupid late mother in the grave? Idiot. Offspring of Lucifer. <laughs> Open your mouth and wag it now, you will. <coughs> Stupid thing. Like this. I beg your pardon. 
Yes, because if you love mommy, you will not be here. I mean, if, if you love me, you will not be treating me the way you do. Look at the moko. Big boy, whatever. I can see you have broad wings. You don't have the guts to ask questions bigger than you. Okay. Since you asked, I will tell you. Now hold your ears. You hold your ears. You see your mother? Your mother is the worst enemy I have ever. She had always been in the habit of taking what belongs to me. She took what was mine. I am here now to take what rightfully belongs to me. And as for you, I don't have any business with you. But since you now have the habit of, of prognosing, you have grown so much wings that you ran to your dad and opened that, that gutter you call him out to tell him you hate Asa. Mwa Asa, you hate me. But wait for that hatred. You will continue to see it in this house. Now let me ask you. When you told him about how I have been treating you, what did he do? Nothing. And he will not do anything. That is because I have bewitched him with the power of a woman. I have it right on my is going nowhere. So if you like, when your father returns from his trip, you run again with this two left leg of yours to him and open that, that hole you call him out and tell him that I've been treating you badly and you will get triple the punishment. I said hold your ears. You will get triple the punishment you are getting now. his ugly face. My friend, get out of here. I am a woman who died. You are a wicked auntie. I hate you. You are heartless. Now get out of here. Uh, come, 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 come back here. I said come here. <laughs> now that you have grown so much wings, I have to cut those wings. And by that, you will not leave this house without my permission. And my food, you will not touch my food until I ask you to do so. Disappear. Hey, in fact, come back. Come here. I said come here. Are you crying? Oh, you start smiling. Oh, smile. I said you should smile. Smile. Why is that your teddy? Oh, Open your teeth. Where is the teddy? It's in your room. I can see that Teddy now makes you neglect your duties in this house. Tonight, I want to see that Teddy in my room. Did you hear me? Did you hear me? I knew you were wicked, and I hate you. You're wicked. You're heartless. Come here. She sees it. my nanny. I can see your mother did not give you proper home training. Overgrown idiots.
said you love me You said you never leave me alone Why did you go away and leave me here And I'm looking for you everywhere Mommy, I miss you I miss you, Mommy He said he, all his friends has gone to that place, so I have to take him there tomorrow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Please don't even start. But make sure you don't look at any girl there. You know me and my trouble.
Let your face again, my girl. He will win Elizabeth. What will your face give to me? How dare you bring in your little slimy self into my home mm. to ask me silly questions? <laughs> Fast. Oh, you don't, don't touch him. Oh. Don't touch him. I see. Louisa, you have gone up. You have come up with my late sister's son to come to my house to fight me, right? Huh? I am not here to exchange any words with you. I am not here to exchange words with you. I only came here to place a lot of money to you. If anything happens to Big Boy here, if anything happens to him, you will have yourself to play. Yes! Do you know what? I'm putting it straight to child right. Yes! Towards your heel mannered attitude towards this boy. And you know what that means? Yes! You know that. 